in Peterborough in our Peterborough store with the legend Jason Boast. Still loves playing golf. Love it. Plays once a week at least. Just Nearly. Um, we're going to have a look in his bag, and more specifically today, we're going to look at his iron. So this season, you've been playing with TaylorMade. Correct. And what's in here? Let me grab one. We've got the TaylorMade P7 MB. Why? Why? Uh, they look shiny. No, shiny. Okay. To be fair, it's last year I played the P770. Loved the iron. Uh, it's great. Um, I just fancy something a bit more shiny, to be okay. honest with you. Okay. I'm gonna, it's probably not the best option in the world for okay. me, for the amount of golf I play, but the feedback off them I'm getting is great. So this is a blade, right? Yeah. This is a pure blade. So and you've got this through the bag, and looks like you've got the four iron in it as well. Maybe so you made a mistake there, but okay. we'll see as we go. Okay. Uh, but yeah, the, the irons are loving it. Um, I've fitted it with a shaft this year, which I've not tried as well. Um, I've gone for something lighter, but I've got it in X Flex. So what is this? This is so dynamic, dynamic gold, gold 105X. Um, I don't swing it, you know, I'm mid 80s. So really, I'm, I'm borderline. That's your that's your swing speed, not your age. Shut up. There we go. So yeah, we're mid 80s, that sort of thing with a seven iron. So I'll hit this about 170 through the air. So, so what you said this is a new shaft, and, and 105 is the weight of the shaft. Right? Yeah. So predominantly, I've always used something heavy. Okay. So like 120, 130 grams. Um, I've always probably used something heavy because I always felt I want that something stable. That's quite a big difference between 120, yeah. 130 to 105. So hence why I've got X Flex in it, really. Okay. It's just to felt like it kept it a bit more stable. Okay. Um, but it just feels a lot easier to use as I'm getting a little older. <laughs> and what and what spec have we got in terms of the lie? What what do you so, play with? So I'm um, standard length. Okay. Uh, I'm two degrees flat, and I've gone two degrees strong. So so why two degrees flat? Why? Because as I hit it, I tend to hit it very. And one of my things is I have a big miss left if I'm going to miss. Okay. So the last thing I want to do is have see have that hill digging in and closing mm. the face. So I always like to see it flat. Um, for me, it looks good on the ground as well. And, and I've always, you know, I deliver around about 58 degrees. Trackman helps us understand that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It, it, that's where I am. So I'm two degrees flat, and also I've gone two degrees strong. Um, okay. These themselves, if I wanted to play them properly to get the distance that I want, I need the 7 iron at 32 degrees, not wow. 34. Okay. Yeah? Because at 34 degrees, I'm not going to hit it 165, 170. Yeah. So I need that sort of thing. And also, I like it, it just sets a little offset. And grip? Right, gone back to my old fashioned grip that I used back in the playing days. Uh, basically, a standard Golf Pride Tour Velvet. Um, they call it Reminder. Um, what do you. It's got a little ridge in the back. Oh, okay. Um, standard grip, three layers of tape. Um, last year I went mid-size, just felt a little uncomfortable. Gone back to what I know. Um, love it. I can't beat it. Yeah. Okay. So this is your setup for this year? Yep. Enjoy playing them? Love it. There we go, guys. Jason's been playing a very, very, very good looking iron, the P7 MB. Not sure he should have chosen the four iron, probably gone P770 in, <laughs> in the end. Um, the old but great set of bats. Nice to see any of our staff, any of our players able to change what shaft and willing to look at different options to benefit their ball flight. Fitted in store by Lewis. Looks fantastic. It's a good set of irons.